Oh my God, I'm so excited to see these falls. I can hear them. They're right down there. I can't wait. Let's see how it is. Oh my God. Look at the color of this water. Holy shit. Kootenai Falls. Holy hell! Wow, these are raging falls. Oh my god. down and it's still so gorgeous oh there's the bridge damn oh my god Franklin's never gonna go on that <laughs> let's see suspension bridge right over the raging water <laughs> holy hell whoa Ways. Oh, we can do it. Come, Franklin. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, holy shit. Oh, Franklin's not gonna go. That's okay, Frankie. You can stay. You can stay, Franklin.
looks with his hair blowing in the wind. <laughs> oh, Franklin, you look so cute. Wow, look at your hair blowing in the wind, Franklin. Wow. <laughs> All right, we're going. Oh, cute little creek on this hike from Old Highway 2, which basically this was a road next to the freeway, as you can hear. But this was the original freeway when they had old Model T Fords and they make cross-country drives in Montana. So it's supposed to be a pretty cool hike, beautiful views. Um, I've got my bear spray, my knife, yeah. So yeah, I think it's gonna be a nice walk. Hopefully we'll get away from the freeway and see how it goes. Wow, this is a weird forest. Like, there's so much hidden stuff. There's like rocks caves or something, a wall up there. Um, wow, I didn't expect it to be so dark and gloomy. Can you imagine driving here like in the 30s and 40s on this road? Like, insane. Wow, look at this old road. And the main freeway is down there. Here's the old retaining wall that they built. You can see it's like very well put together. Oh my God. This is so crazy. So weird, like so much history here. Oh my God, there's literally an old car that fell. <gasps> Look how old this thing is. Insane. Wow, there's the Kootenai River, part of the falls where I was yesterday. Gorgeous river coming online. There's the actual freeway and the beautiful, beautiful sky. I cannot believe I'm in wonderful weather in Montana. I'm so thankful. Whoa, that's crazy. Look, you can see the rocks under the river. The water is so clear. Wow. Oh, that is just gorgeous. Look at that. Insane. This probably goes right back up to the river, too. Wow. So pretty. Just a crazy beautiful walk. Once you get out of that creepy forest in the beginning. Wow. This is so gorgeous. Look at that. Wow. Well, I found a new trail. <laughs> it's quite steep, but it goes to a lake. So obviously, I gotta go find it. I do not see how a lake is all the way up here, but I'm supposed to be close. Whew. Wow, super cool though, but it is summer, and we have been having a drought in Montana, except for the one week that I've been here. Oh, this is not nice water to swim in. It's very stagnant. Wow. Unfortunately, this is very stagnant, not fresh water, so this is not something I will be swimming in. However, wow, what a surprise to find this in the mountains. Incredible.
crazy how it's so much more cold in the shade in these dark areas of the forest and then you go to the sun and it's really warm but in this foresty area with no sun it's really cold it's so funny Franklin and I are walking um, by the train tracks because I saw this beautiful private beach from the mountains yesterday where I was climbing. So I'm trying to find an entrance to go to this private beach area. And I think I found it, I'm not sure. But either way, it'll probably be an adventure. <laughs> There's the raging water, but it goes into this super calm pool area where you can swim. And there's one person here. <laughs> so it's not totally secret because this guy already knew about it. So that's the hills I was climbing on yesterday. And then here's what I saw from the hill where I could go down to. That water is rushing down there, but there's such great areas for swimming here. Lovely place and it's such a beautiful day here.